Hey, what's happening, guys? My name is Saurav, and welcome back to another video for my solutions. And in this video, I'm going to be talking about how you can use ADF feature in the Brother Printer DCP2 TA20 DW uh, model. So, to use the ADF feature, all you, all you have to do is that first you have to make sure that uh, you first need to understand like how the ADF feature works here. So, if you just you can see it, the icon over here. So whenever we are putting the paper here we just have to make sure that the content is available on the downside as you can see like you know the icon over here and we just also have to make sure that no such you know uh, clips and all the pain staples shouldn't be there in the adf so that basically your page will not get stuck inside of the printer so in order to use the adf all you have to do is that just place the paper like this so because the content is present in this side of the paper so we'll have to put it like this as like uh, we can see in the icon here so like once we insert the paper we can just once we insert the paper in the screen here we'll be seeing that the adf ready uh, like a sort of message here so like if i just insert it properly you can see now like adf is ready that is something you can see it here now that means like our page is basically ready for the adf feature so if i just open the tray here so that our page doesn't fall down and if i just click on mono you can see that the ADF feature like has started and it is scanning now. And you can see that the page is printed well. And if you want like uh, to print like multiple pages like on the both side of the you know uh, page. So all you have to do is that just I'll be using these two pages here like this so i want this first part and this is the second part and i want these two pages on the same paper like on the front and back so all you have to do is that i'll just place the paper like this like one on one and once i see the adf ready command here and the adf is ready so all you have to do is that just go to copy and scan option here press up button once again and here we have two sided option we'll have to click ok and we'll have to go down and here we have one sided by two sided if we click ok stop and exit and we'll have to click on mono and you can see that it is taking the first paper and now it is taking the second paper And now you can see that it is taking the paper inside to print the second part of the page. And now you can see that it is printed well on the both sides. And since guys uh, in this brother printer uh, the duplex which is not available so that's why we are not able to print like once we choose the two side by two side option like here from the if we go to the copy and scan option and if we try to use two sided by two side and if it, we try to do it from the adf so basically if we try to do it it is basically giving a message that the duplex feature is not available in this printer so this you this sort of features are usually basically present in the higher level of machines but in this model it is not present so that's it for today guys i hope this video was helpful to you so do not forget to like subscribe and also i'll catch you guys in the next video Bye bye